Good morning, everyone. Let's get started. Okay. Looks like other people have been on board. Okay, so why am I here? Um, I have the last two trades um, to go for the Fletching Trading Hall, but it's taking a while. Um, even though I transfer about 10 at a time, they're all either the last trade is an enchanted crossbow or it's a tipped arrow trade that I already have. So that, it looks like the last two is going to take a while. But um, I definitely do need a break. So I'm going to try um, one last push this weekend. If I can't get the last two, then I'll just take the break and then come back and then, yeah, yeah, and deal with it then. So what I'm be doing, um, when I'm trading with them, I actually created two new structures near the villager trading hall. So let's see how many. Yahoo, Nelly! Iron for days. This is what I get for AFKing overnight. Of course, I won't be able to take all of these um, with me because um, I know, I, in retrospect, in hindsight, I could have emptied out my ender chest so I could put these guys in there. But uh, next time, I think my next trip here, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to empty my ender, empty out my ender chest so I can put all these in here. So let's see how many. Stacks of iron blocks I generated from that overnight stay. And yes, I could have brought a boat with chest. That's the, the other thing that I afterwards I thought, oh dang it, there was opportunities all over the place. Other than that, this is super efficient. No complaints from me here. So how's your Friday going? Um, in my host country, we're going to have holiday. Uh, it's called Labor Day weekend. And that's the reason why um, I posted a picture of what my corn on the cob looks like, I guess. Yeah, it's so funny. One of my housemates from college, her aunt does the exact same thing. And yes, we're doxing each other by saying that, but and she knows who she is. It's it's really really funny. I doubt I doubt that she watches my vods. Um, Anyway, before I get further dogs, both of us, um, yeah, just, this is going to be like a sh relatively short break that I'm going to be taking, um, did I do the right side or the wrong side? Oh my goodness, memory, yeah, this is right one. Oh, the wrong one, <laughs> Yeah, it'll just be a short break. Um, I just need to go into my single world, come up with ideas for the animal sanctuary. And then once I come back on the server, then I'll figure out about placement. Where, where exactly are these things going to go? So that's always the fun part. I basically have a couple of them, two or three of them. Um, those of you on Discord may have gotten a whiff of one of them um, I would definitely would like to make a sniffer farm What's that that sounds like an interesting thing to do you know just you know while I'm working on the animal sanctuary um, the sniffer will grow up to be an adult and I can collect all the drops automatically I don't need to actually physically be there uh, to collect the drops so and the other thing that I was thinking, um, I already have like about almost 64 turtle eggs. I could also sell turtle eggs as well. Maybe um, restart my um, chicken egg farm again. 
because right now um, I pulled all the inventory out of the sh out of my shop uh, for the wither boss fight to hopefully this time get the um wither rose because I have the land unclaimed so that's something so off camera I'm gonna check to see if there are dolls if they are the next episode it's a wither boss fight part two <laughs> I need to block these or I need to change it into blocks. So that'll be a fitting um, start to the weekend. So either it'll go really well or it will go really badly. Either way, it'll be fun content. Entertaining to say the least, so. Do I have any room in my ender chest for these things? Uh, I do have a chest. This is so crazy this might work. Could actually fit more stuff in here. Let me. Okay, if I'm gonna do this, I need to break this, put this back in here. I'll just take the first row. I'm not gonna be too greedy because. I mean, eventually, the goal is to get probably all of these filled up. Oh, it looks like they started here, and then their end goal is to have all of this filled up. Wow. That would take a while. When I'm not on a break, I could contribute, you know, I can help. Okay. Go this way. Oh yeah, I, I still have to raid the fortress, raid the bastion, raid a um, raid an N C D. I still have so many things to do. I still need to find trail ruin on my own. I've already stopped by the one that's near my base. Um, that's already been looted. And there's already a double chest over there with a sign that says, "Hey, if you want anything, take it." <laughs> so. I'm also following suit too. If I find something and I already have this, I just put the sign down. Yes, I raided it, but no, I left some stuff in there. Take it. <laughs> okay. These guys are the same. And this is the silo that one of our server mates commissioned. Um, hi, good morning. <laughs> Comp wished me a happy AFK. So, allies are here. These are green dye, these are nether bricks. So, this, this is really good because if anybody wants nether brick, I could say, hey, I have some. <laughs> Anybody needs green dye? Hey, I have some. So let's go over here. These are still the same. Um, no change. I took some chest monsters out of here. Um, so that's taken care of. Yeah, that's somewhere around here. There, there's. I probably just covered over it with uh, dirt. 
and but it didn't light this area up, so probably it's part of the reason why that's there. I may or may not work on it. Oh, thank you. Sleeping. Oh, here is where I put my stuff. Let me empty out my inner chest as well. Okay, so these guys. I need to get some more emeralds because, yeah, I'm down to my last three. So let me show you which ones I do have. This one, this one, this one, this one, this one, this one. As you can see, I already put the like ones together. So there's three poisons here. There's three regens here. A couple of slow falling, three slowness, three strength, two swiftness, two turtle master, two weakness, one water breathing. So you can tell by that which ones I'm missing. And I'll show you. The water breathe the weakness one minute. That one's not. I haven't gotten that one. This guy is only 22 seconds. Or 30. 30 seconds. Weakness, 11 seconds. I'm just me missing the one minute one. Okay. All these guys are here. The other one that I'm missing is right here. Swiftness, 22 seconds. I do have swiftness, one minute. We do have swiftness 11 seconds. Okay, so these are the only two, and everybody else has been filled in. So, yeah, the last two is going to be a while because I keep bringing, as I said before, I keep bringing 10, other, 10 villagers at a time, but I have not gotten the last two yet. And this is what I built, you know, while I'm, because yeah, when you level up to level up Fletchers, you reach a point where you, they locked all their emerald trades, and the only one that's left, it's like you need flint or you need feathers. And once in a while I do check my chicken farm, but yeah, just, so I only have this many feathers left. And this much flint. So yeah, I when they run out of emerald trades, then they lock up and have to wait until the next day. And during that off time, I built these two things. Now, if I remember, I'm gonna link on the tutorials in the description box below. Um, the person who makes these tutorials, TSMC. Uh, you may have seen some of his other builds and other servers that I've used. Um, I really love his builds. They're really compact and pretty. Now this one, um, he made this tutorial seven years ago when glass panes actually connected to solid blocks. In this version, somewhere between that version seven years ago and today, they don't connect. So it's, rather than glass panes, I actually use whole blocks for this. I'll just leave it open. So I, so yeah, it's it's really compact, really cute. Um, it is possible to squeeze eleven cats in here, but I decided to put some of them out here. So yeah, done and dusted. So now they actually do have a place. Um, I left the other two because the other two, one of them is going to be for the Halloween shop, and the other one. I'm still debating what to do with that one. I'm gonna leave these two here, kind of you know, under the the eaves of this. So, so these two swamp cats, and that that's the child of the swamp cat. So, and the other one is the dog house. Now the tutorial says to use quartz for the bone, but I decided to use bone blocks probably seven years ago um, or whenever they made that tutorial. They didn't have bone blocks back then, so they used quartz blocks, but now we have bone blocks, so I used the bone blocks instead for the bone. So yeah, I gave credit where credit is due. Um, I don't know if he's the original designer, but he does a really 
If you watch his tutorials, he does so many of these awesome builds. Now, this is the mystery here. Probably some of you probably already know where the fourth dog is. I'm still looking for I found one of the dogs sitting like in here on top of one of these workstations. The fourth one, I'm gonna keep looking. I'm gotta be around here somewhere and this is some one of you already knows. Like, I know what happened to that dog. <laughs> this is what happened. some stuff around here and most likely I will probably have to AFK over at the breeder because I probably used up the last one before with, which was the reason probably the reason why I went to the iron farm because I thought oh no more villagers they need more iron to make emeralds so yeah oh one more thing I need to mention before I go over there. I won't mention any names, I won't mention which farm they're going to be making, but... One of our surmates has approached me. Hey, I noticed that your zombie grinder is just sitting here. I would like to convert it into a farm that has not been made yet on the server. And I thought... Oh my goodness! You're right! I keep forgetting to mention, after I made this this um, zombie, this um, copper farm, um, after I made this um, copper farm, I learned later on that somebody already made a community zombie grinder, so you really don't need two community zombie grinders. Okay, now you can hear me better. Um, what I... Yeah, so... I didn't know when I made the community zombie grinder that somebody already made the community zombie grinder, so... <laughs> so one of our soulmates proposed a different farm for this. Not not above. I'm still going to make the copper farm, but... I'm not, I'm, I don't know if they've done any work down here, but... They are going to convert this zombie grinder into a farm that the community... This server does not have yet. I'm not going to spoil it. I'm not going to say who, who approached me. But once it's completed, I'll show you. So look forward to that. So yeah, it's just... Oh, interesting. So I'm not going to go through that portal just in case. Um, with that portal, <laughs> I already, already updated the sign. So if you are on the server, you will know what farm is going to come. Um, so that will be TBA to be announced. So looking forward to that, really stoked. So that will be another project for me to do um, when I get back. I've got to get that copper farm up and running. I forgot which one is this. Um, whichever one is a Trident one, I have not gotten the Trident yet. Um, I did get uh, yeah, this one. One of my surmates, when they were um, hanging up the caves, they got this one. I accidentally picked it up thinking I already got this one, but yeah, sorry. So yeah, there's a couple of discs, uh, a couple of items that I didn't get on my own. Oh, I need seven more stuff. I need to... Huh. <coughs> You know the animals. I need to. I need to find a goat. Axolotl, frog lights, frogs. Okay, I definitely do need to do that. So all I need to do is like the lingering potion, huh? And then the two, two tip arrows. Wait, this one's missing. Hmm. Maybe I'm missing three. Oh. The arrow 
of weeping. I should have these. Let me take a look. Because Grant, so which one is missing? Let me see. Total Master 4. Master two two. Now I wouldn't be here if I'm missing it. Um, there must be another turtle master then. <coughs> maybe I'm missing like not just three, but maybe huh. Watch your breathing twenty two. I need two, two, I don't, do I have two? <coughs> Maybe I just shoved them in there without realizing that I haven't picked up teeth. Uh, what is this? Oh my goodness, I put you in here without, oh my goodness. Okay, what else am I missing? So I got that one. Arrow of Leaping Jumpers. I do need another emerald. Okay, so watch your breathing. And I do need more emeralds, so let me see. I mean, granted, I could do this off camera, but if I can get something done right now. Oops. Let me start with this. Um, so try it again. I'm gonna make sure I get. So this one. I'm gonna have to research this one. Jump boost, one minute leaping. Okay, jump boost, one minute leaping. Are there any other ones like that that I'm missing? Swiftness, I know I'm missing that one. Oh gosh. So the other thing that I need to do, so splash potions, meager potions, I do need, I still need to get the gas, I, I need to make a gas form. Because <laughs> at, the, at the point where I am right now, I'm thinking, you know what? How many gas did I kill? Did I call? I don't look at the number of um, five. See, five I've killed. Didn't get a single gas here. Okay. Um. So this guy is leaping, right? Leaping. Let me move these guys over. The leaping up here. Okay. And, okay, so let's go back to the villager breeder. So yeah, um, got two builds done. Um, before I go on break, I am going to, at least, I'm going to make the, the bamboo form is going to be easy to walk. Sure, Kane, I'll start on it. If I finish it, great. If I don't, then, you know, I'm not going to cry over it, so. Let's go.
Hmm. Oh, there are some villagers here. Okay, how many? Looks like just two. I'm just gonna chill out here. And next episode, I'll show you my progress. Um, show you the bamboo, bamboo farm. And then if I finish this sugar cane farm, great. If not, I'll show you uh, my progress on that one. So I'll just see you next time and have a nice weekend. Bye-bye.